Hello, welcome to Biz World. I'm Gan Ailing. The rapid economic growth in the ASEAN member countries is expected to help lessen the impact of the slowdown in Europe and the U.S. International Trade and Industry Minister Dato Sri Mustafa Mohammed said the members' average growth rate of over 5% was a good sign for the 10 member groupings' ambition to set up an ASEAN Economic Community (AEC) in 2015. Matamat kita adalah untuk merapatkan jurang. Ya. Bila kita meningkatkan integrasi antara negara-negara ASEAN, maka kita berharap negara-negara yang sekarang kurang maju akan dapat ditingkatkan kemajuannya. Dan... He was met after delivering his speech on ASEAN Regional Integration 2015 at the 8th World Islamic Economic Forum, WIEF, earlier today. Malaysia, according to Datuk Sri Mustafa, will always play a key role in encouraging investment collaborations and trade relations among the ASEAN member countries. Meanwhile, at the same event, Bank Negara Governor Tan Sri Dr. Zati Akhtar Aziz said the new Islamic Banking and Takaful Act are expected to be in place next year. This is part of the legislation. There's a, it's called the Financial Services Act, and this is the Islamic Finance and Takaful uh, Act as well. Uh, the effect in the industry? Well, uh, right now the industry is covered by BAFIA and... Uh, the Islamic Financial uh, Services Act will come into operation, we expect, next year. She said the first and second reading for the new ex legal framework has already been heard in Parliament. Commenting on Suku issuance, the country's Suku market, Dan Sri Dr. Zeti said, will maintain a strong momentum next year.